Yeah. Wow. Step out, yell nice and strong, even though we're not together. Hi. That's it. Good. Hands on your belt. One, two, three, four, five, six. And side to side. And then zip. And down. And up. And backward. Forward. And up. And back. And forward. Good. Then reach to the side. That's it. I know it'll be a little bit different working out of your house. That's okay. Switch to the other side. Especially when we do forms. It's a little hard to do them in your living room or in a space that maybe is not perfectly square. And back to the other side. Reach a little bit farther. And we're going to do a few things that maybe we don't normally do in class. Maybe some different exercises. Switch sides. Especially with an adult class, we can kind of experiment a little bit. Good. Heels together. Hands out. And that's it. Bend those knees. Looking good. Good. Step off to the side. We're pushing that knee out. And then switch. It's, we'll be, maybe I'll, I may make some mistakes. I may say right when we're going left, or I say, may say left when we're going right. Turn onto the ball of your foot. And you may go left when we're going right. It's okay. It's all good. We're just working out together, having fun. And then switch sides. We drop down. That's it. Try to keep that back straight, right? Good. Come back up. Rotate your knees. Big circles. Getting all warmed up. And reverse. Okay, we're going to do some jumping jacks next. We'll do a couple different kinds of jumping jacks just to kind of get warmed up, get our blood flowing, but we're just going to start with some regular ones. So let's go, just jack it out. That's it, light on your feet, right? Okay, now some of you may know cross jacks, where you cross your arms. Try that, crossing your arms in front. The advanced version is crossing your feet, too, without falling over. That's it. Looking good. Okay, let's go back to regular jacks. Okay, now these are called jack jabs. So you do two jumping jacks, then you do a jab and a jab. Two jumping jacks and a jab and a jab. It's a punch to the face, not what we would do in free sparring, right? Jumping jack, jumping jack, jab, jab. But it's just a tight punch. Punch, jack, punch, punch. That's it. Jab, jab. That's it. Good. Nice job. Okay, now just going side to side a little bit. Don't forget to breathe. Okay, now we're just doing side to side, getting your feet warmed up. And now step over, knee up. Step over, knee up. Step over, knee up. That's it. You're getting your feet thinking about moving. You're getting your knees thinking about coming up. Okay, now bring it up and throw in a big circle. Bring it up, throw in a big hip circle. Oh yeah, warming those hips up. Can you bring your knees up a little bit higher? Especially if your name is Leland. I'm looking at you, Tom. Looking at you, Fred. There we go. Nice job. Good model. Good. Okay, so we're going to do some hand combinations, some techniques, and we're working on technique today. Okay, so that we're going to start chimney position. Hey! Do a bunch of techniques out of front stance. We'll do some out of back stance. The way we're going to do it is two forward, two backward. So, for example, if we're going to do middle punch, step forward, middle punch, step forward, middle punch, step backward, middle punch. Step backward, middle punch. We'll come back to Chumbi and we'll do something else. And we may do those, we may do more than just two forward, two back, but that's, how, that's the pattern that we're going to go with. So let's start with low block. So you're setting your hands. Ready? Step forward, low block. Step forward, low block. That's it. And now set your hands over your lead side and step backward, low block. And set over your lead side, step backward. 
Low block, good, I think we got the hang of it. Let's try it again. So now we're working on technique. I want front knee bent. I want all 10 toes facing forward. Ready, set your hands. Low block, set them in low block. Good, and then set, and we're gonna go backwards. Low block, and set, and go backward. Low block, nice job, remember, one fist distance. Good, one more time on this. We're gonna speed it up a little bit, ready? Go, one, and forward, and backward, block, and backward, nice job, good. Now we're gonna do middle punches. There's lots of things that we kind of let slide a little bit on technique, but middle punch is something that we all need to be able to do and do well. Middle punch is not here, okay? It is not at my shoulder, okay? It's not out here beyond my body boundary. It's right here, right in the middle. So let's work on that. Pull your hand to your waist. We're gonna step forward. Middle punch, I wanna see everybody with a middle punch. Not punching your patch. Okay, that's it. Right in the middle. If you're straight out from your shoulder, that's not a middle punch. Bring it over, bring it down. Good, let's do one more forward. Middle punch, good. And now backwards. Middle punch. I wanna see it, there we go. Thanks Kim, you've got it. Step backward and punch. That's it, good. Now two forward again, ready? Hey! One. Hey! Hey! Backward. Two. Hey! And backward, good, nice job, bottle. Very good. Okay, now we're gonna do high punch. Okay, and we're doing three to the nose. Okay, so you're gonna step forward with your right. One, two, three, ready? Hey! Step forward, one, two, three. And do it again, hey! One, two, three. And now remember the nose, okay, right at your nose. Hey, backward, one, two, three. Hey, backward, one, two, three. Nice job, let's do it again, going forward. Hey, one, two, three. Hey, one, two, three, that's it. And backward, hey, one, two, three. Hey, and backward, one, two, three. Good, bottle, hey, good. Now we're gonna try single block. Remember your, your hand will go low. When we used to teach this with white belts, we used to say, like you're reaching for your sword. You step out. You pull your sword out. That's the motion that we want. Okay, so you set your hands. Ready? Hey! Step forward and block. Nice and strong. That's it. And then set your hands. Hey! Step forward and block. Good. It should be right at your shoulder, right? It's not outside your body boundary. It's not up. It's not down. Right off your shoulder. Good. And we're setting our hands. Ready? Stepping backward. Hey! And block. Hey! Step backward and block. Good. Nice job. Now we're going to move forward again. Same thing. Two more. Hey! Step forward and block. Hey! Step forward and block. Hey, that's it, and backward, hey, backward, hey, and backward, hey, good, bow, hey, all right, we're going to, the last one we're going to do is knife hand, striking right to the, um, striking right to the neck, when you're stepping backward, we're really not just stepping back, okay, I really want you to move backward into a stance, not just walking backward, but think about charging backward into a stance, Setting your hand, charging backward into a stance. Good, so we're gonna set our hands. We're gonna start with the left, ready? Stepping forward with your left, knife hand strike, right to the neck, that's it. And hey, step in, knife hand. Good, and now set your hand and we're moving backward. Hey, step into your stance, strong. Hey, step back into your stance, strong. Good, you gotta set your feet, build your foundation. Two forward, ready, hey. One, hey, set and strike, that's it. I like that power. One more time, hey. Set and backward, right to the neck. Hey! And backward. Nice. Uh, bottle. Hey! Good. Do a few things out of uh, back stance. So we'll start with middle knife hand. So you're going to set your hand. We're going to step forward into your back stance. Remember, shape of an L, and your, the strike should be right below your shoulder. Okay? So we'll set our hands ready. Hey! Step forward one. We're still doing two forward, two back. Hey! Step forward, strike. That's it. Good. If your chest is not facing straight in front of you, turn it. I don't want your strike so strong that your arm comes out here, right? Okay, now set your hand. We're going to step backward. Hey! Good. Backward into your stance. Good. And your hand sets up on your shoulder. Hey! Backward into your stance. That's it. Nice job. Now two more forward again. Hand up. Ready? Hey! Step forward and knife hand strike. Good. And one more time. Hey! Step forward and knife hand strike. That's it. Good. Don't let your chest turn. Keep it. Keep it facing straight forward. Ready? Hey! Step backward and strike. Hey! Step backward and strike. Nice job. Now let's try middle knife hand block. So set over your lead side. Ready? Hey! Step forward, middle knife hand. Good. Everybody hold position and drop. There we go. Get into that stance. There you go. Y'all looked at your feet. Good job. One more time forward. Ready? Hey! Step 
and block. Good. Now you have to set over your lead side and step backwards. Height. Step backward and block. Nice job. Set your hand. Step backward and block. Nice job. Let's do that one one more time. Height. Set. Step and block. Oh, and drop that weight again. Big L with your feet. Shoulder facing forward. Height. Set your hands and make it strong. I want those uniforms snapping. Set again. Ready? Height. Step backward. Block. Step backward and block. Good. Nice job. I like that synchronicity of the Leland family. Okay, we're going to do forearm block. This is Palmach Maki. Set over your lead side. Ready? Height. Step forward. Okay, same idea, but your hands are closed. Blocking with your wrist instead of the knife part of your hand. Ready? Height. Set. Step. And block. Let's put some power into this. Okay, this is a block. Somebody's attacking you. You have to block it away. Height. Step forward. And block. And one more time. Set it in front. Height. Step backward. And blocking strong. Nice job. One more time forward and back. We're going to do back fist. Set your back hand up. Ready? Step forward into your back stance. Back fist. Good. We're coming straight out like you're hitting somebody on the side of the temple. And set your hand. Ready? Height. Step into your back stance. Strike. That's it. I want some power. I want to see those muscles. Okay, ready? Height. Step backward. Strike. Step backward. And strike. Nice job. Bottle. Back to your chibi position. Height. Good. So we're going to step back with your right leg back. We're just going to do straight leg exercise. We'll do across the body. We'll do the diagonal. And then we'll go into some kicking. So we'll start. Ready? Straight up. One. And down. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Good. Switch your feet. Nice flexibility. Everybody's looking good. Okay, let's try on the other leg. Eight times. Ready? One. Up. And down. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Looking good. Seven. Eight. Good. And bottle. Good. Okay, now remember we're going to go diagonal. So setting that leg back again. You're trying to bring your knee across your body towards your shoulder. Okay, but not torquing the knee you're standing on, right? Ready? One. Across and come back. Good. Two. Across and come back. Three. Across. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. And switch feet. Nice job. Let's go right away. One. Two. That's it. Three. I hope your legs are getting warm. Four. Five. Six. Seven, and eight, and switch sides. Okay, now similar motion. We're gonna go across and around, making a big wide circle. We're only gonna do six on each side. Ready? One, big circle. Oh, that's it. Two, up and around. Three, nicely done. Four, five, six, and switch your feet. Other leg, are we ready? One. Up and around. That's it. Nice job, Mike. Two. Three. Oh, reach it up there. Four. Five. And six. Good. Up and around. That's it, model. Nice job. Good. Okay, so we're going to work on a kicking drill. We're going to stay in one spot, but we're going to be kicking in different directions. Some of you may have done this drill before. Okay, so we're going to start left leg back. Everybody got it? It. Good. So we're starting with front kicks. We're doing one in each direction. Okay, so the direction that you're moving is towards your open side. Okay, so from here you're coming around one, pivot two, pivot three, pivot four, kick, and set it down. And I don't want this. I don't want your knee dropping and coming back up. That's too much extra energy. Okay, I want your knee up. Hold it up there all the way around and set it behind, okay? So ready? Let's try four kicks, one in each direction. Ready? Sijak. I got one, go to the side two, to the back three, to the side four, bring it in, set it down. Good. And the other thing, after that fourth one, you don't want to do kick and smash it onto the floor and drop out of it, right? You want kick, pull it in, set it down. Did I see a yawn down there? Oh, somebody's in trouble. Okay, let's try that leg again. Ready? Same thing. <laughs> One. Front kick. Two. 
three, four, bring it in, set it down nice and strong. And you gotta come back into your fighting stance. Nice job, switch sides. Now we're gonna do the opposite leg, you go the opposite direction, front side, back side, ready? One, front, pivot two, to the back three, to the side four, set it behind, and set it softly. Good, that's it. I wanna see hands up from everybody. Let's try that one again, ready? Hey, to the front, to the side, to the back, to the side, pull it in, and come on back strong. Nice job, let's switch sides. Okay, we're gonna start on the other leg. Now we're gonna do round kick. So same foot position, right? Ball of your foot. Think about a table being all the way around you and you wanna just keep your leg like it's on the top of the table all the way around. So again, I don't wanna see you doing kick, drop, kick, drop. I want your kicks to be the same level all the way around, okay? So focus in, tight abs, front side, back side, ready? Hey! So we got turn to the front, round kick, turn to the side, round kick, turn to the back, and set it behind. And put it back. Nice job. Good. Don't forget to breathe. Let's try that leg again. Ready? Hey! Bring it around. One, two, three, ball of your foot, four, pull it in, set it down soft. Looking good. And switch legs, please. There we go. And our hands are up, right? When we're kicking, we're not airplanes. Our arms should not be out flying wild. Your hands, arms should be in close. Okay, so we're doing round kicks, one to each side, front side, back side, ready? Hey, front, side, back, side, set it down softly. That's it, that looks so good. Let's make this last one a double. Two round kicks on each spot, ready? Go, two at the front, two to the side, two to the back, two to the side, Bring it in, set it down softly. And there we go, nice job, switch your sides. Very good. All right, we're gonna work on side kicks. I don't want this one to be about speed. I really want this one to be about awesome side kick technique. If you remember back when you were a white belt and you were learning side kick, remember what we said, your knee comes way up, right? Okay, and then you get like to, you know, brown belt, you just kick really fast. Okay, you can kind of cheat it a little bit. Okay, you know what I'm talking about. All of you have been in this for a while, you know. It's pretty easy to just kind of come up and do sort of like a round kick position, but then throw a side kick. Let's work on getting your knee up, okay? Let's work on knee straight up, okay? So your leg's back. We're going that same direction. Your knee's way up, side kick. And then I want it way up here, side kick. And then I want your knee up every time, ready? Let's go, one, two, three, four. Hey! Bring it around, one. I want that knee up, two, three, Four, set it down softly. Not too bad, let's try that again. Tight foot, right? Ready, hey! Bring it around, one and two. I'm seeing some knife blades, I like it. Three, looking good, Miss Carlisle. And Joanna's got it, good. Let's switch sides. Opposite leg, tight foot. Remember your knee straight up to the ceiling, right? And then pivot and kick strong, ready? One, good, two. Three, oh, bring that knee up. Four, pull it in, set it down. We're back in our fighting stance, ready to go. Let's do it again. Hey, side kick, side kick, side kick, side kick. That's it, nice job. And switch sides. Okay, very good. We're gonna do, do hook kicks. It's a little variation of that. Still your knee, right? Straight up, little um, side kick to the side, hook it across, hook kick. And then you bring your knee way back up again each time. Ready? We'll do it together. One, bring it up, hook, pivot, hook, pivot, hook, pivot, hook. Bring it in soft and set it down. Nice job, let's try it again. I'm gonna watch, ready, go. Bring it on hook, that's it. Try to control your arms, okay? There we go, this is right here. Oh, the Kirsch's. Mr. Kirsch, your hands are looking really good. Nice job keeping those up. Okay, switch sides. Let's try hook kick on the other leg. Ready? Hey! Bring it around. Hook, 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 hook. Control those hands. Beautiful kick, Miss Carlisle. Good. Let's do it again one more time. Hey! You're looking good. Hook to the front. Pivot, pivot. It's not easy, especially if you're on carpet. I know it can be tough. 
And finish off. Good. Nice job. So switch sides. So we're back to that original side. Okay, we do a couple kicking combinations and then we'll go into forms. So this is a combination I like a lot. It's front kick, back kick. So it looks like this. Front, pivot all the way around, back kick, and set it behind. Okay, so let's try that one together. You do not set your feet down between the two kicks. It's a front kick. Your knees up, you pivot around quick, and you do your back kick. Ready? Let's try it. I saw one up there from long. Ready? One. So I got front kick, pivot, pivot, two back, kick, fire it off, and set it down. That's it. Good. We're using your body, your momentum, right? Kick, pivot, kick, just continue the turn. Let's try it again. Ready? Hey! Bring that back leg up, kick, pivot to your back, kick, and then put it behind. I like it. Okay, hands are up. Let's do it again. Ready? Hey! Bring it up, kick. Nice job, Alfonso. Good. And switch legs. Let's try the other leg now. So we got the same idea. You're doing your front kick. You keep that knee up, fire off that kick, set it behind. Whenever you turn your back to your opponent, you don't know what they're doing. Okay, if you're free sparring, you turn your back, they hit you in the back. So you have to turn quickly. The very first tournament I went to as a yellow belt, doing free sparring, I didn't know that you really didn't do a lot of back kicks in free sparring at tournaments. And I really liked back kicks, so I'm doing back kick, and I kept getting scored on. And I learned, you got to turn quick. Okay, so leg is back. Ready? Hey! I got front kick, pivot around, back kick, set it behind, and we're back strong. That's it. I like it long, looking good. Ready? Try again. Hey! That's it. Front kick, Master Daquan, you got it. Spin back kick. There we go, Mr. Gravel's looking good. Let's try one more time on this leg. Ready? Hey! Front kick, turn, 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 back kick, fire it off, bring it in, and set it down. Nice job. Good. We're going to switch legs. Okay, your back leg's going to come forward. We're doing the outside, inside crescent kick, and then the side kick. I think you've all done this one before. We know that crescent kick, you just kind of batten something out of the way. Maybe somebody's legs kind of hanging out there. They threw a punch, they kind of left it. You're knocking it out of the way. The side kick though is your, that's your scoring kick. So you're gonna come around, crescent kick, and then boom, side kick, and set it back. Ready, we're gonna try three of those. Back leg comes forward, ready? One, bring it around, crescent, side, set it back behind. That's it, I like it, Mr. Gravel. Two, bring it around, crescent, side, and set it behind. Well done. And three. That's it, Mr. Rolls. Great kick. I like that high kick. And set it behind. Good. Switch your legs. Okay, we're going to try the opposite leg. You're doing crescent kick side. I want that blade of your foot pointing right at the camera. Ready? Hey! Crescent, side, and then come back quick. Good. Look at the wongs. Doing great. Two. Bring it around. Crescent, side. Nice kick there, Joanna. And three. You know, Dung has a great kick. Whoa, I could see the blade of his foot. I about cut my hand on it. Good job. Okay, so switch your legs. Okay, now we're doing inside to outside, and then we're doing a front kick. So we're doing inside to outside crescent kick, holding your knee up, front kick. Again, that crescent kick, you're just knocking something out of the way. You're opening somebody up so you can do your scoring technique. So your back foot comes forward, your knees up, crescent, hold it up there, front kick, set behind. We're going to do three on each side. Ready? One, bring it up and around, and then nail them on the front kick. Good. Two, bring it up and around. We did those hip openers earlier. That's what we were thinking about. And three, up and around, knocking something out of the way. Hold it up there. Kick. That's it. Switch your legs. Opposite leg. Last time. Ready? One, up and around, and then front kick. That's it. Try to keep your head steady. Don't tilt your head around. Ready? Two. Bring it up, crescent, front, set it down, that's it, and three, up, here, and back. A nice job, bottle. Very good. Okay, we're going to go through some forms. I know we have some advanced belts and some lower belts, so we're not going to go all the way up, but we'll start with, our, with some basic forms that we all know. Okay, let's get a bow. Chumbi, step out and yell. Okay, Chun Ji Hyung. We're just going to do it at my count. I'm going to watch. Remember, don't orient yourself to the fireplace or the front door or wherever you are in your room. Think about what's actually a 90 degree turn for your body. If your body's facing this way, there's 90 degrees. It doesn't matter if this is a crooked wall or there's no wall. I could be out at the park. Okay, you have to orient your body 
not to the space that you're in, okay? So we're all in chimney position. Let's set your hands, ready? One, turn low block. Two, seven punch. Three, we're turning into your low block and getting into that and foot position, good. Four, step forward into your front stance. Five, that's it, command that front stance. Six, we're on punch, that's it. Seven, turn low block. Eight, nine, here's your single block. That's it, 10, step and punch. 11, back the other direction, that's it, get low. 12, step and punch. 13, single block left. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 is backward, 19 is backward, hi again, Joanna, and 20. Yeah, you froze up for a minute. We thought maybe we'd lost you, but glad you're back. All right, <laughs> good to see you. Okay, let's do uh, Dangun Young, second form. We'll do this one at my count as well. Bao, chumbi, hi. Ready? Remember, we're engaging with our stances here. You're not just walking into it. I want you to really set it. One, back stance, strong fingers. Two, a punch. Three, four, five, so long in the nose, good. Six, seven, eight, gotcha, Mr. Duvall. Nine, that's it. Twin forearm block, 10, step and high punch, 11, 12, step and high punch, 13, turning low block and then high block, good, 14, high block, 15, high block, 16, 17, knife hand strike, turn your back, good, 18, 19, 20, and 21. Okay. That's it, good. Okay, let's do dosan. We're gonna count that one out at my count too. And then Lung, we'll have you just go through the, the three forms that you know and everybody else, we're gonna move up a few more. Okay, so we're on dosan. We're gonna do this one again at my count. Ah, chumbi, hey. Okay, you're gonna set your hand. Remember back, hands are back to back. Turn into the left, one. Out of form block. Two, no punch though. Three, step together. Step out and block, four, punch, five, middle knife hand, good, six, step forward, spear hand, and break, good, now step for back fist, seven, turn around back fist, that's it, eight, back fist, nine, set your left hand on top, outer forearm block, ten, little punch, eleven, step together, step out, twelve, punch, thirteen, here's your X block, good, fourteen, Front kick, 15, punch, 16, punch, 17, turn the other direction, 18, 19, 20, good, 21, high block, 22, high block, 23, turn all the way around, horse riding, and knife hand, good, 24, and bottle, that's it. Master deck one, is that a wall that's right there? Is that <laughs> Got it. <laughs> you were kind of hovering out there. <laughs> Very good. Okay. And Joanna's finished. Nice job. All right. So we've gone through the, the first three forms. We're going to continue up a few more at your own count. So long, you can start Chunji, Dangun, Dosan. You can go, go through those three, you know, one at a time as we move up. Okay. So we're on form four, Huan Hyo, bow. Feet are together. Hands are up. Okay. Go at your own pace. Ready? Suja. Oh, does he? Oh, okay, very good. Long knows that one too. Sorry about that. I couldn't see the stripe for sure. Good. Pull it in. Good. Middle knife. Middle knife. Middle knife. Very good. Spear hand. Good. Twin forearm block. Good. Separate out all these moves. Master Kim, he always said, every movement has a meaning. Okay, we're not just throwing an arm or a leg out there. We're actually doing something, something important. That's it. Nice job. Very good. 
I can't hear your kips because you're muted, but I can see that some of you are doing them. So well done. And back, good. Okay, yoga kyung, bow, jumbi, hi. Ready? Sija. That's it, keep going. Looking good. Remember pulling those toes back on your front kick. Lead with the ball of your foot, not with the bottom of your foot. That's it. That's it. That's it, and you got it. Elbow, good. You're with us. Fams are looking good. Nice jump there. Well done. Back. Just waiting for everybody to get all the way through. Double fisted block, double fisted block, and back to attention. Good. Okay. Chungan hyung, bow. Ready? Okay, show me that strong ridge hand. Ready? Suja. Hey. Ridge hand, front kick, palm block. That's it. Now the other direction. Ridge hand, front kick. Some good looking foot position out there. Well done, everyone. Very good, everyone. Remember keeping those arms up, right? Right, Mr. Rolls, don't drop that back hand. Keep it up there. Looking good, looking good. Uh-huh. That's it, Hyun, looking good. Okay, good. Let's do Toy Ge Hyun. Bow. Ready? Sija, hi. That's it, keep going. <clears throat> Good. I know it's tough to do forms in an unfamiliar environment. I've done forms in my living room, in my kitchen, in my backyard. It's not easy. And if you've been out of class for a while, it's hard. I came in a little early today to get through all of my forms. Could have been, been a week or so. I haven't left my house. That's it. I like this synchronization there, Jennifer. That looks good. I think so. I think it's just the, the right, it's the seniors in the Kirsch household. Fam family looking good. I think the kids are going a little faster than everybody else. That's it. Nice job. We do two more. We're going to get up through the color belt forms. Okay. Huarong Hyung, bow. Ready? Deep breath. Sujak, hi. Back. That's it. Punch, punch. Work on your technique. We talked about it earlier. I want you to command your stance. You're not just walking forward, you're stepping into a front stance. You're stepping into a back stance. You got to command it. Okay, you're in charge. That's it. Nice job, Mr. Leland, Stephen Leland, I can see you. Great hand position, looking good. You too, Christina. That's it. Miss Leland, I think your, your blocks are in a little bit close. You were here. You can bring it out a little bit. Single block, low block. They just looked a little bit like that, but it might be the distortion of the camera too. But good job, you guys. Okay, last one. Chung Woo Hyung, bow. Chung Mee, hi. It's the last one. Finish strong. Ready? Sija, hi. Go, go, go. Let's see strong techniques. There it is. I think that's Andrew, right? Caught himself. Way to self-correct. Good job. Good job. Finish strong. Remember those side kicks, you got to get your knee up, right? We just did it earlier. Bring your knee to your chest. Don't turn it into a round kick with a side kick foot position. That's it. We're finishing strong. Looking good. Looking good. Back. 
Oh, and somebody fixed his pants there in the middle of that. <laughs> I'm not going to call out any names. <laughs> Very good. We're finishing, making sure everybody gets done. Okay, nice job. Jana, good. Back to Chimbi. Okay, so my recommendation is if you have never filmed your own forms and watched them, I think that you should do it. And this is a really good time. I mean, we all got a little bit of extra time on our hands right now. Set up your laptop or your phone or uh, camera, film yourself doing your forms and then watch them. And watch by yourself because there might be some crying, some, <laughs> for some hysterics. When I watch my own forms on film, I just cringe and it's awful. I think I'm doing pretty good and then I see, you know, of course your own little, little mistakes jump out at you. Everybody looks good, but you're your own worst critic and you always see every little tiny flaw that you have. So it's, it's, a, it's a good learning experience, but it's, just, it's not that much fun. But like I said, do it by yourself. Okay, we're going to work on a little bit of dodge and counter. And we're, um, Master Ron and I were talking before class. We're going to try to do a little bit of experimenting with this. This is a fun format. We've never, you know, we've never taught classes like this before. We're used to being in the room with each other. So we're going to try some dodge and counter. I'm going to attack, and you're going to dodge. So when I attack... I'm going to come right at the camera. I'm going to be attacking right to you, okay? So you need to dodge to one side or the other, and then you need to do a counterattack that's appropriate, okay? So everybody starts in their fighting stance. Oh, I saw an elbow strike there, I think, from Mr. Kirsch. He, just, he let me have it. That was a good one. Okay, so hands are up. I'm going to attack with whatever kick. I'm going to start with just some random ones, and then we're going to work on a few things after that. But just to kind of get warmed up, just to see how this works. So I attack. You're going to dodge off to the side and throw a counterattack kick of some kind. Okay, so ready? Here we go. And dodge, counterattack. Good. That's it. Good. I'm seeing a couple of techniques. That looks great. You can do a kick. You can do a hand technique. Okay, ready? I'm attacking again. That's it. Dodge, counterattack. There we go. Good. That's it. Let's try it again. Ready? You're all set. Good. I kicked right at you. Good. Dodge into the side. Good. Okay, so we're going to try a couple things. I'm going to tell you what kick I'm going to do, and I want you to kind of watch for that so that when you are free sparring with someone and you see that technique coming, you kind of know what to do. So if I bring my leg around to do a round kick from the back, if I come around and do round kick and set it down, my back is over here, right? That's my blind spot. So that's where you want to be, okay? If I come around to do my kick and I'm here, I can't counterattack. I can't block you because you're back there, okay? So if I come around here to kick, what, side, what direction do you need to go? That's it. Ms. Carlisle just did it, okay? She just dodged. So that's it. So we're going to do that together. I want to see everybody dodging to my back so that you can hit me right in the middle of my back because I can't defend it. Ready? Around, kick, you dodge, that's it. Everybody went that way, good job. Let's try that again. I'm gonna do a hook kick this time, but my leg looks the same, right? I'm still bringing it around. Okay, ready? Wait, bring it around, hook. Everybody's dodging that way and hit me in the back. Very good. Okay, so this time I'm gonna start with my other leg back. We'll try that again. So if I come around and do round kick, where's my back? Yeah, you got to go the other direction, right? That's it. So you should hit me right in the middle of the back. Good. I'm going to do a reverse jumping side kick. So watch for this. I'm going to bring my back leg up. I'll be flying forward, but my back is still going to be the same way. Ready? Up. Kick. Oh, and there's my back. And you should all be hitting me. Good. Andrew got me in the back of the, back of the head of the back for this. Nice job. Okay. Let's try that again. I'm going to do a reverse jumping round kick. Same idea. I'm going to come up and around. Ready? Mm -hmm. Ready? Here. Up. And dodge, quick. That's it. Nice job. Good. Okay. So I'm going to do, I'm going to switch my legs again and my back foot's going to come forward. Okay. And I'm going to do a front kick. You've all seen somebody do a front kick at you in fighting, right? Here it comes, but I set it down. What side do you think you should go to? Yeah. And I saw, I saw people going both ways and it kind of depends. Good. I saw Ms. Carlisle. She dodged to the side did a knife hand right to my head. I think Mr. Gravel went the other way, okay? But yeah, I'm open right here, but if you dodge far enough that way, you get to my back, and I can't turn that way, okay? So let's try a couple with front kick, okay? And I want to see a good counterattack from you. 
and maybe two techniques, maybe a kick and a hand technique, both. So watch, here comes the front kick, dodge out of the way, and good, that's it. Let's try again, I'm gonna switch legs, I'm gonna do front kick again, I'm gonna bring my back foot forward, I want you to dodge quick, do two techniques, ready? Hey. Bring it up, kick, dodge, that's it, nice job. Good, part of, part of being a good fighter is just being able to see quickly what your partner's gonna do and then anticipate what they're gonna do based on the cues that they give you, how they bring their leg up, okay? So we're also going to try, uh, we only have a few more minutes, we're going to try a little bit of shadow fighting. Okay, so I'm going to be your opponent. Okay, I'm just going to move around, I'm going to throw kicks, I'm going to dodge around a little bit. Okay, it's going to look different for everybody, but you're just kind of trying to follow along with me and do uh, a fight against me. Okay, as though we're together. So everybody step back in your fighting stance and yell nice and strong. Hey! Okay, we always start with a good key up. Okay, ready? Sijak. So I'm just throwing kicks at you. Oh, and here I dodge, so you gotta dodge around. Okay, turn to my back. Oh, there, go to, quickly go to the side. Climb over here. Here comes a front kick. Dodge to the side quickly. Good. Okay, maybe I'm way over to the left. So turn, you gotta kick toward the left now. Oh, and then I dodge to the right, so quick over to the right side. Oh, and then I backed up, so you gotta move in a little bit. Come in at me. That's it. Oh, and now I'm coming toward you. So you got to back up, back up, back up. Good. And then I dodge to the side again. So quickly over here. Good. Good. And then I'm throwing a jump kick. So be ready to quickly come in and do another kick. When you see someone doing a jump kick, they're going to jump, kick, and land. And that's your time to attack. Good. 30 more seconds. Let's go. Okay. I dodge to the side. Oh, that's it. Throw a kick. That's it. Oh, here comes a jump kick. Be ready. Throw a kick very quickly. That's it. Oh, and I dodge to the side. I'm coming in at you. I'm coming in. You got to back up. You got to back up. I'm attacking. You got to back up. Oh, and then I'm backing up. So come in toward me. Move toward me. That's it. But don't kick your camera. I dodge and bowl. Nice job, everybody. Good. Good. Come back to attention. Ah, Jimby. Hey. Good job. Left side center punch. Hey. Good. We're in a horse riding stance. That's it. Good. We do 50 punches. Ready? Go. We're chambering all the way to the belt. We talked about this earlier, right? Middle punch. We don't punch at the patch. We don't punch at the shoulder. Punch the middle. Right where the rib cage comes apart. That's it. Finish strong. 50 punches. And bottom. Well done. Good. And we'll finish. Good. Okay. Let's grab that left ankle, pull it up behind you. That's it. You want your legs parallel to each other. Your left knee points straight down. Just pull that foot in. Turn to the side. So you pull that foot in really close. That's it. I just want to show it to you. There you go. Good. Okay. And then same leg, kick it forward, and you land. I'm going to back up so you can see it. Put it on the heel. Just kind of pushing back a little bit. Not on your knee, but right above your knee, stretching out your hamstring. That's it. Okay, now with that same leg that's forward, put it back, and you're on the ball of your foot. Same leg. We're still working on that same leg. Push your hips forward. You're on the ball of your foot, if you can see my foot in your camera. Pushing your hips forward. We're stretching out that quadricep. And now drive your heel down. Stretching out your calf. That's it. Good. Now switch legs. So here we are. You got your right knee up. Point your right knee at the ground. Pull that leg in tight. You're stretching out your quad here. And kick it forward. Pushing down on your thigh a little bit. Kind of stick your wallet back. You bend it back a little bit. Pushing down, hello hamstring. Pull your toes back. Nice job. Okay, and then kick it back. And again, we're on the ball of your foot. You're pushing that, pushing that hip forward, stretching your quadricep again. And then drive your heel into the ground. Stretch all the way up the back of your calf. That's it, good. Now facing forward. Your hands come out, cross them, and then, oh, there you go. Lace your fingers and then push away from you. 
Reach out toward the camera. Reach, reach, reach. You're stretching out your upper back here. That feels pretty good. That's it. Reach, reach, reach. And then reach the other direction. So you're lacing your fingers behind you, stretching out your chest. And lift your hands half an inch, one inch. Oh, there we go. Good. Okay, and back to attention. Good. Feet together, back straight. Repeat the five tenets of Taekwondo. I just want to see your lips moving, everybody. Courtesy. Oh, we're going to unmute somebody. We, I'm not going to tell you who it is. Somebody's going to be unmuted. So I'm going to, you're going to say it with me. Ready? Courtesy. Integrity. Perseverance. Perseverance. Self-control. Self-control. Indomitable spirit. Indomitable spirit. Who was it? Peter. It was Peter Lee. Nice job, Peter. <laughs> well done. Okay, that was really fun. Thanks, everybody, for joining in. Got a clap there. Good job. Well done, class. Good. Thank you.